Hey, what's up everybody? Today we're looking in a Mack truck and I'm going to show you how you can adjust the uh, date and time and other settings. So what you're going to do is uh, turn the key to the first click and the ignition there. You don't want to start the motor though, you just have it on that, on that first notch. And it's going to go through all of its... Uh, data this whole little process it does you're gonna be adjusting all these all these settings with the uh, with that right stock you got the uh, escape and the enter button there and now on the end you have the uh, up and down arrows to a pick what you're gonna pick in the menus so anyways it's gone through its process and uh, I'm gonna hit the enter button and I'll bring up the menu. And while the motor's off, you get this you get the different uh settings. With the motor running, you don't get this extra arrow that goes down. So uh you go down to that arrow and it brings up this other menu. Let's see if I can focus that. Anyways, it's the maintenance, diagnostics, and setup. And uh, so you're going to go to Setup, which is the bottom one. It's hard to see for some reason. Anyways, Setup. Then you have Language, Units, which will change from gallons to liters. Date and Time. That's the one you want to do if you're going to adjust the time. So you'd hit Enter on there. And so you change it from 12 hour to 24 hour or... There we go set the time and date and then change the format so I already set the uh, time so this is good you can uh, change the light so if at night time if it's the display is too bright for you you can change the, the backlight or the contrast and uh, that's about it like I said um, while you're driving that arrow doesn't come up and you can't adjust those settings but you can see the gauges and the other fuel economy and trip info while you're driving and the motor running but you can't adjust the other settings and uh, then one of the other things I found out too I turned the ignition back off and uh, so you don't have the key and you want to check your miles you just hold the the enter button, and it'll pop up, and I'll show you the uh, your miles and your total engine hours. So if you're like at the pumps or something and don't want to crank it up or whatever, but uh, that's about it. Thanks for watching.